with all the latest in news, sports, and entertainment. You're watching the Boone TV Buzz, Iowa's most watched high school news show. Hello Boone High and welcome back to the Boone TV Buzz. Thank you for joining us for the week two news show where we will bring you all the latest in news, sports, and entertainment from this past week. Let's take a look at what has BHS buzzing. With football season here in full force, another BHS tradition has returned. Boone TV's Anna Olson has your recap of the second annual Under the Lights competition. On Friday, September 7th, RSVP hosted their second annual Under the Lights competition. This event allowed students to be players rather than spectators by showing their competitiveness and skill on the Torridor field. So last year I did Under the Lights and we did it with the cheerleaders and it was super fun and all the competitions we get really competitive but this year it was even more fun. We did it with the cheerleaders again and we always just have a really good time. There were many games and activities involved in the event such as team chant, egg toss, pudding dig, somersault high five, and tug of war. There were so many fun activities and it was pretty challenging and it was just a good time to hang out with friends and just enjoy my night after the game. Raising student voice and participation enjoyed putting on the event and organizing the fun games. RSVP had a great time putting on this event and we had a great time watching the students participate and have fun. The night ended with a dub by the Spirit Squad team. They will be receiving the winning trophy and pizza. This has been Anna Olson from Boone TV. This fall, Boone High is seeing a change in the chemistry of the science department. Boone TV reporter Elaney Parker has more on science teacher Miss Wason. There are many fresh faces on the Boone High staff this year. One of these new teachers is science teacher Miss Wason. She comes to BHS with a fresh new perspective on teaching chemistry, physics, and biology. I used to hate science, admittedly. Uh, and then my 11th grade year, I took chemistry and my chemistry teacher made me realize just how awesome science is and it's something um, that's throughout all of the world. You can't escape science, right? So that's something I want to bring to my students. Not only does she inspire hands-on activities, but she plans to have a positive working environment for her students as well. Um, her teaching style is pretty interesting and it definitely keeps me entertained during class. I really like Miss Wason and I'm excited for the experiments that she has planned for us. Though her primary passion is science, she is also getting involved with other activities at Boone High. I plan to volunteer as a speech coach since I have a background in speech um, from my previous experiences at UNI as well as in high school. Miss Wason is looking forward to the experiments of this upcoming school year. This has been Elaney Parker from Boone TV. The art department also has a new educator joining the ranks here at Boone High. Boone TV's Paxton Swanson has more on Mrs. Tiedman and what she hopes to bring to our community. There are many new faces in the halls of Boone High. One of these new faces is art teacher Mrs. Tiedman. This new addition to the staff is looking to start her career off on the right foot here at BHS. I want each student to walk away feeling like an artist and having created something that they're really, um, that is really meaningful to them and that they're really excited about. Mrs. Tiedman creates an environment that allows students to be themselves. She lets you express yourself in any type of way and she lets you write everything on paper and she won't look at it. Outside of the classroom, Mrs. Tiedman has plans to be involved in the community. Well, I've been thinking a lot about how I could bring parents in and have art, um, art events with parents and with community members. And then maybe in the future starting an art club could be really cool. So we'll see. Despite this being her first teaching job, Mrs. Tiedman is looking to make an immediate impact. This has been Paxton Swanson for Boone TV. 
This past Friday, September 14th, the football team traveled to ADM, looking to gain our first district victory. Boone TV reporter Quentin Wilson has your recap. The Boone Torridors are at ADM tonight to take on the Tigers. Boone is looking to put another win under their belt before they start their district play. Let's get to the highlights. ADM started the game with Tate Smith finding Nathan Conrad open for a 15-yard pass, allowing the Tigers to get a first down. Conrad then found Butterick Smith open for a pass, getting them to Boone's 10-yard line. With 10 yards to go, Nicholas Bradshaw busted through the line into the end zone for the first points of the game. On Boone's possession, Tyler Cassati found a gap dodging four defenders for a 60-yard touchdown march, adding seven points to the Torridor score. ADM then came back with a touchdown of their own as Smith slips through the line for a 78-yard run, making the score 14-7. The Tigers controlled the rest of the first half, scoring three more touchdowns by a score of 36-7, heading into halftime. To start out the second half, the Torridor defense put pressure on the Tiger offense, but Bradshaw broke through the line and dashed into the end zone, adding seven more points to ADM's score. However, Boone did not let this stop them as Gage Moraine recovered a fumble from ADM to take over on downs. Morgan Smith then found Tegan Bach open downfield for a 40-yard touchdown catch. The Torridors tried for the two-point conversion, but Smith's pass to Alex Sturtz fell incomplete. The Tigers continued to control the game, scoring another touchdown and taking the win 49-13. You can catch the Torridors next game at 7.30 p.m. this Friday at Humboldt High School. This has been Quentin Wilson from Boone TV Sports. Thank you for joining us for this week's news show. We will be back next week with all the latest buzz at VHS. In the meantime, please head over to boontv.com to check out all of our latest videos and written stories. While there, don't forget to like us on Facebook, follow us on Twitter, and subscribe to our YouTube channel. And now, from all of us at BHS, make sure you stay cool, stay safe, and have a great week, Boon High.